As long as you know you could have taken any cards, you could have shuffled in any particular way, and this is where we end up. In a, in a position where none of us could have preempted the order of this deck ahead of time, and that's important. Now, Louis, may I do this with you? Sure. You are going to get, you're going to determine the final order of this deck based on where you cut. So I want you to take uh, roughly half the cards and place them into my hand. And from the point at which you come, okay, which is less than halfway, but that's fine, from the exact point at which you come, we'll weave these together and this will be the final, the final mix. Okay, it doesn't have to be perfect, as you can see. But had you have cut any more, any less, there'd be different cards going into different cards. And I want you to push them together. And now we're ready. So, Louis, do you have a phone on you? You can bring yeah. it up. And I want you to go to your clock and, more importantly, go to your stopwatch. And we'll just pop that here so everyone can see. In a moment, I'm going to ask you to press start and we're going to basically whittle down a deck of cards. Right? Okay. So, go with your first uh, instinct on this. So, press start for me. In a deck of cards, you've got pictures and numbers. I just want you to name pictures or numbers out loud. Whatever you say is what we remove. So, go ahead. Numbers. So remove the numbers, that leaves jacks, queens, and kings. Which one do you want, jacks, queens, or kings? Queens. Yeah. Okay, uh, do you want this to be a red queen or a black queen? A black queen. The black queen. Last choice, clubs or spades? Clubs. I'm going to stop there. The moment you said clubs, I stop the clock. Now, you can see, uh, you ended up with a queen of clubs in exactly 20 seconds. Yeah. Now, these are the variables I'm talking about, right? <laughs> because had I have asked you to do this, you might have answered in a different time and you might have given different choices, right? Now, somewhere in this deck is the queen of clubs. Okay. All right. There's 52 cards in this deck, which means there are 51 chances that the queen of clubs is not at the 20th position. And there's only one chance that it is there. Now this isn't a trick, I'm not going to touch the cards. I want you to deal with one at a time and count to the 20th position. And we're looking for the Queen of Clubs. Alright, so pick them up. Alright, deal them face up one at a time to the 20th card. One, two, two three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen. Stop. 19. That's the twentieth card. It is. You could have said anything in any time. <laughs> yeah. It's all about being in the right place at the right time. Turn it over. Drum roll. <laughs> Easy. <laughs>